Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video segment, we're going to change the, the power steering filter in a 2016 Hino. If you're not a subscriber, just hit that button over to the right, become a subscriber right away. And the only thing we want to use, we need is disposable gloves. You can choose to do so, and definitely a rag. We're going to pull the cover off, off the top. And you notice it's a shame they had to put no step no direct water spray. Now I can see no direct water spray, but no step. Now that we had the cover off, we're gonna take off our filler cap. And if you look inside here, there's a cup, I'm gonna pull that up. And it has a screen. And that's what catches any kind of debris, any type of object that should not go inside of your reservoir. That's what this is for. And now, what we need to do, you need to push down on this lock here. You can turn it to the left or turn it to the right. And we're just gonna pull it straight up. And this is our power stem filter. Now, this is a good time that if you want to flush your power stem system, only thing you have to do is just loosen one of these hoses here. It doesn't matter which one. And just let your reservoir actually drain out. We do need a drain pan. You can loosen either line. I decided to loosen this hose here. There we go. All right, we're going to reconnect. And we're going to go back with Destron transmission fluid. If you get a brand new Hino, you need to change your power steering filter at 3,000 miles, the first 3,000 miles. After that, you change it every 36,000 miles. Well, this is our new filter. It's the part number and the price range. Let's see if I can just, you got it taped off pretty good here. And you don't have to put anything together. Drop it right back in. And just push down on it. Make sure we lock it back in. That's very important. Locked in. Before we put transmission fluid back in, let's not forget to install our screen. There we go. and just replenish. We have made it to the maximum line level. We'll put our cap back on. Make sure it's tight. And we'll put our cover back on. And that's all it takes. You're good to go. You have flushed out your reservoir and you have changed your power steering filter. I hope this video was helpful. Do not forget to subscribe. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. Take care and God bless.